Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Nathan. Uh, I want to say good morning, everybody. Went to the east to the west coast. Hope you guys are enjoying your day today because, as we all know, it's Wednesday. Yes, indeed. And you know what that means? Comic book day, or everyone who loves comic books goes down to their little comic book store, their stores and get all the comics in one. And um, yeah, to me, I'm going to I'm gonna get my comics. I'm going to download them. And uh, you know, this is a comic book haul for the week of. The 21st of August 2013 and uh, let's get right into it and, and right off the bat we're going to start off with DC uh, first one I'm going to get is Superman Unchained issue number three uh, now so far on this on Superman Unchained I, I think that Zack Snyder has done a good job um, writing uh, this new uh, book for the Man of Steel, uh, you know, uh, Jim, uh, Jim Lee's art is very good, this one, even though I think that there are some parts we need some improvement on, and, um, you know, last story we had uh, Superman confronting the army and Lois Lane's father, where we got to see uh, the the uh, U.S. Army's, uh, um, well, I think, like, their version of Superman, you know, and he wants to fight the man to himself, so that'll be very interesting. Looking forward to that one. Uh, next one, uh, Justice League Dark issue number twenty-three, continuing the Trinity War storyline. Uh, last issue uh, we had um, Pandora. No, I'm um, sorry. Uh, we had um, we had the woman who was responsible for everything confront Lex Luthor in prison and want to give him the box so that he, he can open it. Just as he was about to do that, Wonder Woman and, and her team came in to stop him. And Wonder Woman grabbed the box and she was, she, she became Pandora, I guess. So, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to what happens, happens just, you know, just a little dark. This is part five of six, so we only have one more before we head on to Villains Month. And I'm really looking forward the ending to uh, how it all uh, goes down for, for each member, each team of the uh, of, of the uh, just league. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, okay, let's see. All right, next one: Batman and Nightwing, issue number 23, formerly known as Batman and Robin, which, as you all know, lately we've been getting each member of the Bat family in past couple of issues. And Red Hood, Catwoman, Batgirl, uh, Red Red uh, Red Robin, and now we're getting Nightwing. It's called Second Chances. I'm really looking forward to this issue and um, what happens between Nightwing and Bat and Batman because we all know the two of them have a uh, good relationship. Um, you know, it, it all started when you know Dick Grayson was brought into the Wayne Manor when his parents was killed, and that's when. You know, Bruce Wayne and Dick Grayson became Batman and Robin, and I'm really looking forward to this issue. I think so far, um, this is um, a very good series between the Bat family, and I'm looking forward to see who, who the next Robin could be. Now, it may be, uh, I think, well, I think, Terry Kelly. I think she she's one of them, and uh, another another. Um, I think another woman, I forgot her name, but it, it can either be either one of them, so looking forward to it. Let's see here, what else we got for DC, or is that it? Oh yeah, there are a couple of tie-ins to Training War, uh, like Training War, Training of Sin, Pandora, not issue number three. Um, I've been behind a couple of issues on that, so I really don't know if I'm going to get it or not. Um, Anything else? I'll see here. <clears throat> okay, here's another one from DC Wonder Woman, issue number twenty three. Uh, last issue of Wonder Woman I read, I enjoyed it, and uh, I want to send a big shout out to uh, Sleepy Rio 666. Um, 
he recommended for me to try it out, and uh, I have heard good things about it. I just haven't read it in, in the past couple of issues, but last issue I read it, and it was very good. I enjoyed the writing. I enjoyed, you know, how one woman is portrayed in this, um, in the book, and um, looking forward to the story in, in this one. That uh, I think we're finished here. We have more. Do you have anything else for DC? Uh, no, that seems to be it for DC. And um, let's get right into let's, yeah, let's go right into Marvel. Kicking off with that, we have Daredevil issue number thirty. Now, last issue I forgot to get, uh, I forgot to download, but so I'm gonna catch up on that issue, then read this issue. But on the cover we have Daredevil and the Silver Surfer, so you know that's gonna always be good. And uh, <clears throat> this what last issue. And on before that, was a two-part story arc, so I'm looking forward to that. I mean, yeah, I'm looking forward to um, this two issue uh, between the Daredevil and the Silver Surfer. So, um, I'm enjoying Mark, Mark Waite's writing on it, and I think he's doing a good job, and hopefully he stays on this book, probably, you know, forever, because I really like Mark Waite and what he brings to uh, brings to Daredevil. And like uh, Mount Vernon Kid once said, uh, Mark Magic Way. You know, he has a lot of magic in his writing. Okay. Up next. Alright. Uh, next one we got. In the Shadow Ball Hall, issue number 12, Agent of Time. Uh, last issue was the start of a new story arc between the, the Inestructible Hulk and Bruce Banner and trying to figure out what was, what's been going on with the uh, timeline and all because as we all know in Age of Ultron uh, the timeline is all messed up and now it's up to uh, Bruce Banner slash Hulk to figure out what's going on so Mark Wade again is doing a good job on that looking forward to it and the cover looks beautiful looks great uh, we have Hulk I think riding a dinosaur or, or something so, I don't know what that is, but, yeah, I'm looking forward to the Instructable Hulk, issue number 12. Next one, we got... All the Comics, Ultimates, issue number 29. This is continuing the last issue where we all thought that Tony Stark was dead. And a part of him is still alive, basically, which comes to the suit. It's kind of like a, an extremist. Sort of. What, and if you guys don't understand, read the last issue to understand and figure it out. But I'm really looking forward to this issue of All the Comics, Ultimate Issue Number 29. And hopefully, you know, uh, Reed, Hulk, and Quicksilver get their actions handed to them. I can't stand them. Um, and even though, you know, this is the Ultimate Universe, you know, there are some things I don't like about, uh, such as Reed, which is this, this functional man who will do anything to control the world. Hulk is just, you know, because I feel for Bruce Banner and I think that, you know, he's being used. He's already being used by, by Richards, you know. And, um, Quicksilver is just, you know. But anyway, uh, moving on. Let's see here, what else we got? Okay. Avengers issue number 19, uh, part of Marvel Comics. This is part of Infinity Saga we got going on right now. Looking forward to that, seeing what happens. And um, so far, I think John Tank has done a good job with this. Um, I know it's I know this is a little bit early, but right now I think Infinity is. It's up, kind of up there with Train War, you know, and um, to me, it's not Infinity is not Avengers versus Secret Avengers versus New Avengers. That would just be boring. But you know, we have Avengers versus Thanos and his allies, so that's good. Yeah. Um, okay, and next is Spirit Spiration number sixteen. Looking forward to that one. Seems like we got the Hobgoblin. On the cover here, he's hurt and he flames hurting, so looking forward to that. Okay. 
than anything else. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, that seems that seems to be it. Uh, there are no uh, independents that I'm really interested in this week of downloading. So yeah, um, yeah, yeah. So the books I've talked, I, I said I talked to you guys about. I'm gonna get that and see what happens. And um, yeah, tell me in the comments below what comics you're getting, what comics you're not getting. Um, hit the like button, like this video, hit the subscribe button, subscribe to my channel. I uh, hope you guys enjoy this day. Hope you guys enjoy reading your comics. This Nathan saying peace. Take care, guys, and I will see you guys next week, or maybe because you know with you know, semester back. Um, I'm not sure on, on how I can do the comic book hauls, but I'll do my best to get to them. And if you don't see a comic book haul, but you guys know that, you know, it's fall semester and I have to stay focused to my work and my studies. So, yeah. And uh, I'll try to see you guys next week. It's Nathan saying peace. Take care, guys. And I will see you all later.